In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to navigate the Shopify platform and make some essential adjustments to your store settings. This will be particularly helpful for those of you who are new to Shopify or looking to fine-tune your store setup. Setting up and managing a successful online store can be a breeze when you know your way around Shopify, so let's dive right in. To start, you'll want to open your web browser and head over to Shopify's homepage. Once you're there, log into your store's admin dashboard. You'll typically see the home dashboard once you're logged in. Navigating to this dashboard is available through the admin URL provided by Shopify, which you might want to bookmark for easy access. Now that you're on the home page, it's time to start making some adjustments. Next, look for the Settings tab on the left-hand side of your admin panel. You'll find it at the very bottom of the menu. This section is like your store's control room, where you can manage everything from payment options to shipping configurations. Clicking on Settings will take us further into customizing our store. Once you've clicked on Settings, we'll focus our attention on the Checkout section, which you can find among the list of options that appear. Go ahead and click on Checkout to open up the settings that govern how your customers complete their purchases. This area is crucial because it determines the checkout experience for every visitor to your store. A streamlined checkout process is key to reducing cart abandonment and enhancing customer satisfaction. Within the checkout settings, you'll see various options related to customer information. Our next task is to find phone number or email under the Customer Contact section. Click on this option to reveal additional settings that pertain to how customers can be contacted during the checkout process. You might notice options to require or make optional certain details from your customers. It's essential to fine-tune these settings in alignment with your store's policy and customer expectations. Finally, Let's adjust the setting to make providing a phone number optional by clicking on the Optional option. This will allow your customers to provide their phone number at checkout if they choose, rather than mandating it. This might improve user experience if some customers prefer not to share their phone number. However, remember that how you set this up might also affect things like delivery notifications or customer service follow-up. By accomplishing these tasks, you've taken a crucial step in streamlining your Shopify store for smoother customer interactions and efficiency. Make sure to save any changes before exiting the settings area. That's all there is to it. Keep exploring and tweaking other settings to optimize your online business fully. Thanks for watching and happy selling with Shopify.